Okay, this is uh, Harold's Prokrok Show Part uh, 60, entirely dedicated to the famous English Prokrok band Gentle Giant. Uh, Gentle Giant had a unique sound and uh, they made uh, eight good studio albums and I will talk about those eight studio albums and the live albums. The live album, sorry. Um, this is the first one, it's from 1970. And it's simply called Gentle Giant, and um, it's a, it's a, a very good album. I really like it. Um, on this this one is on the Vertigo label. I will show you the label, Vertigo. And um, on this one we have uh, Funny Ways and Nothing at All, uh, and a very short song at the, at the end, The Queen. Okay. A, a great uh, album. I highly recommend it. The first one, simply called Gentle Giant from 1970. Then we go to the second one, Acquiring the Taste. It's also a really good album, a proper classic. Uh, I like it a lot. And on this one, we have uh, Pentagrel Grealis Nativity. Okay, good album. Then we go to Three Friends. Three Friends is, in my opinion, their best album. I like it a lot. It's a prog rock classic. And on this album, we have Prologue, School Days, Working All Day, Peel the Paint, Mr. Class and Quality, and the title track, Three Friends. The title track, track Three Friends, is a very bombastic with lots of keyboards, great vocals, good drums, good bass work, and nice guitars. And um, that's really a very melodic song, Free Friends, the title track, and it's fantastic. This is my favorite Gentle Giant album. If you don't know the band, start with Three Friends, this album. It's a great one. Okay, then we go to Octopus. Octopus is their fourth studio album, and the artwork is done by Roger Dean. It's a good album. It's interesting. I will show you the artwork. Okay, this is uh, a sleeve done by Roger Dean, who also did albums, album covers by Yes, uh, Greenslade, and uh, Asia. And Batcher, uh, this one is from Gentle Giant Octopus. I will tell you who are in the band. The lineup is Carrie Minier, all keyboards, a vibraphone, Raymond Schulman, bass, violin, guitar, Gary Green, guitars, Derek Schulman, <coughs> lead vocals, and alto saxophone, and Philip Schulman, saxophones. And John Weathers drums. Okay, six men in the lineup uh, and the three Schumann brothers. Okay, this is classic. Octopus, a very good album. Okay, then we have the next one. It's In a Glass House. It's also a good one. In a Glass House from 1973. Uh, the Power and the Glory, very nice artwork. I really like it. The Power and the Glory. Okay, then we have Freehand. Freehand is also a classic. Uh, there are many Gentle Giant fans who actually uh, say Freehand is their best album. Uh, on this one, we have just the same. On Reflection, Freehand, Time to Kill, His Last Voyage, Taliban and Mobile. That's all on the Freehand album. Uh, then we have Interview. Interview is the last good studio album by Gentle, Ad Gentle Giant. I can recommend this one. Interview. Uh, then we have the live album, the official live. It's a good one. Um, after interview, uh, Gentle Giant made uh, three other albums. 
and uh, those last three albums I don't like and in my opinion uh, the artwork of those last three albums is ugly. Okay, then we have two final copies. This is the first one, simply called Gentle Giant. I will show you the giant. This is the giant with the six band members. Okay, a giant with gentle. And uh, then <laughs> we have the live album. From 1976. And in the inside cover of this live album, you see the map uh, where they go through Europe, uh, America and Canada uh, with their tour in 1976. Uh, actually, on YouTube, you can find the 1976 uh, official concert. It's a great concert. Uh, I was born too late, so I've never seen them live in the 70s. I learned this band at the end of the 80s. Okay, this was my show about Gentle Giants. Uh, give me a like, subscribe to my channel, and uh, write something in the comments below this show this video okay thank you bye